Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to today's video. Um, this week I thought I would do a bit of a random one for me, one that I haven't done before. And it's like a what I wear in a week video, but like with me and George. Um, and I don't know whether I'll be able to do this every single day because it is like mad rush in the mornings when he goes to nursery. But it's Monday morning right now and I thought I would just show you what we're wearing. We're going to go for a little play date with one of our friends today. Um, so it's like super casual, comfy mum outfit, but hopefully I don't look like an absolute like sack of potatoes. Um, so George is just here, he's playing with a few bits, but I'll show you what I'm wearing and then I'll show you what he's wearing, tell you where everything's from, and then I'll link it down below, like Monday's outfits, Tuesday's outfits, Wednesday's, etc. Like I said, if I manage to do it for every day of the week. God knows if I will actually be able to, but like I said, yeah, I'll link everything down below and I hope you enjoy this video. I just get a few questions about like, George's clothes, my clothes, so I just thought I would do this at video um, because it's a quite easy one to film for us and hopefully it's somewhat interesting. This is what I'm wearing today. It is a very casual, super comfy and super, super warm outfit. And I'll tell you why, um, it's really warm. And this is like my biggest tip throughout the winter months, it's obviously like the beginning of December and um, it's freezing. So um, in order to look like not terrible, but still be really warm, I wear thermals underneath everything. So hold on, let me get my like legging thermals out. These ones, see underneath absolutely everything. Um, and I absolutely love it. So I've got the thermals underneath, which are from M&S. George is just, appearing in the background there um yeah so they're from M&S super affordable I think they're like 10 pounds for the top maybe 15 for the leggings or like vice versa so worth it I put them literally underneath everything I'm actually going to get an extra pair this year because I got these in a size the the thermals that I've got underneath in like a, maybe 10 and I think M&S comes up M&S comes up a little big yeah George right um so yeah anyway thermals underneath from M&S, amazing, um, and I'll link them down below as well. Then I've got these um, like leather look leggings, but they are more like trousers. Like they're quite, um, like they are quite thick and they're lined. They've got like a fleece lining as well. They've got a button and like a zip and everything. So they do feel a bit more like trousers than leggings, I would say. I have these in a size medium and they are from Zara, which I feel like is a little bit big for me now, but this time last year when I bought them, they fit me perfectly because I was a little bit bigger where I'd literally just given birth in the September. Um, but because I wear them with like my um, thermals underneath, they're actually all right plus. I feel like they do, in the black, they come up a little bit smaller. I think it's the dye or something. Um, I've got these in the cream and I've also got uh, some in the like tan colour as well and I think they come up bigger in those colours so anyway um, yeah so these are those leather trousers I always get questions on these I love them so much super high waisted really really comfortable and really warm and then this jumper underneath I've got my thermal top underneath and then my it's sort of a jumper but actually it's like really thin it's like a knitted top thin knit I guess um is from H&M ages ago but H&M knitwear you can never go wrong all of my knitwear is from H&M pretty much all of that noise is George in the background but please ignore um and then my oversized shirt is from Tesco um F and F I got this in like a size I think 14 let me double check. Yeah, so it's a size 14 and I'm like a UK 10. So this is a size 14. So I got like two sizes bigger so that I could um, like have it really oversized. And then my cream boots, which are from Miss Pap. Um, I absolutely love these. I absolutely lived in these kind of boots last year in the black color, which I've actually got again this year, but I've bought some like really, really nice ones that are gonna last me for like years. Cause my ones from Zara last year, were destroyed i wore them too much and um yeah they just did not they like the soles were like coming off and stuff so i've got these ones in the cream um and then i've got like some proper like nice ones from arquette in the black because i know that i'll wear them year and year and year after year um but yeah that is my outfit for today i'm just going to chuck on a jacket and then i will show you what george is wearing this is the jacket that i've just chucked on it's super cozy it's my jacket from fnf i show this all the time on instagram as well size 14 i got again two sizes bigger so that i could layer underneath because i've got my thermals on underneath i don't feel like i've got to put like 
more layers on and this isn't like the thickest well i mean it's thick enough um but it's not the thickest coat but like i said because i've got my thermals on i don't want to overheat so this is my outfit for today i might put a hat on but then then you take it off and you've got hat hair like i don't really know so um yeah this is my mum outfit today and then i will show you what george is wearing it's pretty much all zara george show everyone what you're wearing what are you wearing little man okay Right, so I um, don't know how I'm going to do this like elegantly, but George is currently wearing a cream hoodie with George written on it. It's got a couple of stains on it. It's from Zara. Do you like it? Yeah. Look, you've shown everyone. It says George on it. You can get a from Zara. And then you've got some ribbed charcoal leggings, haven't you? And then some socks. I think they're just from Tesco. Oh, I'm so sorry, chicken. He's then going to wear this hat, it's from Tesco, um, and what I love about this hat actually is the fact that it's got Velcro underneath, so he can have it like this, ready, gonna stick it like this and show everyone, do you want to put it on? Have it like this underneath his chin, and then he can't rip off the hat. Okay, should we go have a play date? Yeah, let's go have a play date, chicken. Okay, we're gonna go have a play date. We'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. Bye! Morning guys, it's now Tuesday. It's 6.30 in the morning. It's still dark out. Um, I'm just about to go and wake George up. I'm ready for work. I'm going into the office today, so I thought I'd show you what I'm wearing if any of you gals are working mums too. Um, let me show you quickly. This is today's outfit. I am very impressed with myself hair-wise because this is day six. Six of not washing my hair, which is Frankly gross, but dry shampoo works miracles. Um, and I just don't, don't, I just don't have time. I just don't have time. I need to wash it tonight. I will wash it tonight. I will do that. Um, but yes, yeah, so I'm gonna wear this like midi maxi dress. I don't really know what it is. Um, it's from ASOS. Underneath, I've got a roll neck on. I've obviously got my little G necklace. Um, this is yeah. So the dress is from ASOS. I've got black tights on, and then just these boots. These are from NS. Um, proper like work attire but I'm going to be nice and cosy in the office um, and yeah not cold but also not looking like an absolute toe hopefully just about I actually can't decide whether to wear this headband or not because it really goes with this dress but I kind of like my hair like this I'm not gonna lie plus we wear headsets um, when we're on the phone in the office and with a headband and a headset like it just is too much so I think I'm gonna go and get George um, and then after breakfast, I'll get him changed. He's going to nursery today, obviously. So it's one of them days where he's not going to be like in his best clothes. Like he's going to be in clothes that I do not mind if they get absolutely ruined because pretty much every everything gets ruined. Everything gets ruined at nursery. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you guys my coat. This is my work coat from Zara. It's got a hood and I love it. Um, I got it last year. But they have similar ones that I'll link down below. Um, I love it. It's nice belted. Looks really cute. You can cinch you in. Look really like posh but also just so cozy and i just i'm all about that especially with this hood i'm sorry but little red riding hood who love it um so yeah this is what mum's wearing today let's see what george is wearing so george is having his breakfast right now he's wearing his little clark shoes these are literally the only shoes that he's got um like his first ever shoes oh my god he's got like play-doh on the bottom of them probably but they're just from clark's and he found them really easy to walk in at the beginning when he started walking because they're like nice and curved and really Soft and squidgy, so that's the shoes that he wears pretty much every day with every outfit. He's got, you probably can't see properly, but he's got this like all-in-one um, like romper from Asda on, haven't you? Oh, he woke up and he was very sad, so I'm sorry, darling. <laughs> She's having some breakfast, and then his jumper's going to be this one from Tesco. It's just super cosy and perfect for like this time of year and then his coat is his nursery coat from M&S this was actually a hand-me-down though so um, I'm not sure if they still stock it but gorgeous I absolutely love it um, perfect for nursery nice and warm but also waterproof and yeah love it and you can wipe it down perfect so yeah that is what George is wearing today he does not look very happy with me does he um so yeah I think I'm gonna wait for him to have his breakfast and we're gonna shoot off to nursery you ready to go to school look at you you look like a granddad. You cute little granddad, that's what you are. I know, I know. Let's go then. Come on then. Get your coat on. Yeah, 
see you guys tomorrow good morning guys it's now wednesday i am working from home today but i've got to take george to nursery so i just thought i would pop on before i do that to show you what i'm wearing i'm just wearing loungewear today it's my girl of muse loungewear set i I'm obsessed with these guys. I've did I've done reels and things like I've shared them on Instagram. I'm, I love them. Literally, I live in them. If I'm honest. So this is like the oversized um, sweater, and then I've just got the brown leggings, which I'm obsessed with. Um, and then again, I've just got my cream boots that I showed you the other day. And then I've just chucked a hat on um, because I washed my hair last night, and then I fell asleep with it wet, so it looks like death. <laughs> but also, it's cold outside, so I thought the hat would be. Nice little touch, plus it's the right colour, matches my boots. And then I'm just going to chuck this on. And then this is my coat from FNF, like I showed you on, I think, Monday. Um, so yeah, this is my little school run outfit. But then as soon as I get back, hat off, coat off, boots off, literally just loungewear. It's absolutely perfect. Love it. Well, this is what George is wearing. If you'll come here, he's not a fan of this in the mornings. I don't know why I decided to film this video, but... George is wearing all Georgia Asda stuff, aren't you? We've got a Georgia Asda jumper on, Georgia Asda leggings on, and Georgia Asda socks on. That um, jumper, I absolutely love. It gives me absolute Zara vibes. <laughs> anyway, this is what little man is wearing today. You're going to wear your nursery coat, and your nursery hat, and your nursery shoes. And then we're going to go. <laughs> Don't think it's a day that either of us want to go to nursery or work, but needs must, hey? <laughs> Love you guys, see you tomorrow. Good morning guys, it is currently Thursday now and I am dressed, I'm ready. George is actually having a, it's a little bit of a lie at the moment, it's about half past seven and he's got a health visitor appointment very soon. So I am dressed for the occasion, I mean not really, I'm just warm and um, but not in loungewear, do you know what I mean? So I've got my leather look leggings from zara these are the tan ones i love them they've got like a massive side zip here so i can get them on and then when i do them up they're nice and tight and they're so cozy they're like fleece lined not fleece lined but like f they're nice they're really nice they're like 19.99 highly recommend um and then i've got my arquette boots these are so last year i had some from zara and um, that were very very similar to these ones like chunky boots um, and I loved them so much that I wore them every single day and the soles fell off. <laughs> so I decided to invest in some like really, really nice ones. These were like £100, but I'm hoping that they're going to last me for like five, at least, you know, like three, four, five winters um, because I do wear them so much. However, this year I've bought the uh, cream ones and I seem to be wearing them more. So I thought I'd grab the uh, black ones out, but... Anyway, I've just got a black um, little shirt underneath. You know the ones from Primark, the little, you know the ones. Um, and then I've just got this um, jumper from H&M. Lovely, I love this colour, like nice oatmeal colour. It's my fave. Um, so yeah, that is my outfit for the day for going to um, the health visitor. It's freezing today. And I actually looked out the window and there was like frost all over the cars. So I'm going to wear my big, big, big warm coat that i'll show you in a sec i can't lie nothing for me beats being cozy um this is the wombat and co coat the thing that i love about this one it's like super warm and i just love it generally but what i do love about this is there's a um section that you can zip in the middle here and if you wanted to like wear your baby so on a baby sling or on a baby carrier, which I do with George when I walk Molly, the dog. Um, I'll have him in the carrier and then I'll have like a, there's a little zip section that um, can be added to this, um, or any coat technically, any coat with a zip. Um, then you can, like he can be nice and snug and cosy in there. So that is what I do normally, um, which is why I do like this coat, but generally, um, this is a size 10, this coat, and it fits me perfectly. So I would definitely say, like, say shoes of size and stuff if you were going to get one of these. I got it last winter. Best decision ever, especially when George was tiny. Um, but yeah, I do love it. It's not, it doesn't really go with my outfit, but I don't care. I'm warm. And then this is what George is wearing today. He's just wearing a little um, khaki tracksuit from um, Primark. It's from Primark. It's one of these, like go to things for nursery he's just got that on it was literally a, like five pounds for the set madness um and then his green socks to go with it and then 
What does it say? It says kindness crew. You're in the kindness crew, George. He very rarely returns home in the outfit that he goes to nursery wearing. Very rarely, hey. Come here, darling. Because you have about six pairs of, um, six sets of clothes in your nursery bag. And sometimes he comes home wearing completely random things. But uh, it's all good, isn't it? That is what he's going to nursery in anyway. I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, it's actually now Saturday because I completely forgot to film on Friday. We were literally just in loungewear and George was in like the most bright and colorful clothes, like completely not <laughs> clothes that you would want to buy, trust me, like really messy clothes for um, nursery. But it's Saturday now and we're going on another play date with another one of my sort of mum work friends. Um, she actually had a little boy the exact same day in the exact same hospital as George um, and we work together but we haven't seen each other literally we've seen each other once since we were given birth which is mad because of the pandemic all that kind of stuff so I'm heading out to go and see her now me and Georgia George is just I don't know what he's doing but I'll show you what he's wearing in a second um, I am just wearing my favourite chunky jumper from H&M I love it I love the colour Everything about it is from last year, but I will try and link something similar down below. And then my like shacket coat that I just wear like non-stop is from FNF, like I said earlier in the week. And then I'm just wearing my black leather trousers. These are from Zara. And then I'm wearing my black um, chunky boots as well from Arquette, which again, I will link down below. Um, so yeah, that is what I'm wearing. But I also actually, part of my outfit is, I guess, Wow, George has just smashed something off the side. Part of my outfit, I guess, is this bag. Um, it is actually something that was sent to me as a PR package. And I am... And I am absolutely obsessed. How gorgeous is that for a changing bag? And it's massive. Things I've got in here, obviously, like, all of, like, you know, snacks and George's juice and wipes, nappies, all of that kind of stuff for changing. But also I've got like his coat in here because we're going to go in the car first. So I'm not going to get the coat out. Um, he's got his coat in here, his hat, his gloves. Um, also my hat and scarf and gloves should we go to the park or something. Um, so I am absolutely over the moon with this. I'll link the company down below. It's called Luli Baby. Um, and I am obsessed with it. So like genuinely... Look how nice that looks for a changing bag. You can wear it sort of over the shoulder like that if you wanted to, but it is like also a rucksack, which is probably how I would wear it because it's just a little bit more practical. Obsessed, it goes with my outfit. Literally couldn't wish for anything more. Plus it's massive, which massive win for me. Absolutely love it. And then George is currently wearing, what are you wearing today? Um, Actually all Zara, I think. So these are like some waffle, oh no, you've seen your snack. <gasps> Might have to give it to you. Um, so these are just like his waffle knit um, leggings from Zara. These are really, really nice and warm for him. Um, and then he's also got a jumper on from Zara, again, knitted. I just feel like this is such a good... Oh, he's got a stain on it. But, I mean, doesn't everything have a stain on it, George? I absolutely love your little jumper, though. I absolutely love his little jumper so much. His little leggings are so cute. And then, obviously, his dark shoes. The only shoes that we have got. Um, but, yeah, that is George's little outfit. Plus, actually, I'll show you quickly his coat, which is in here. Because I'm not sure if I've shown it this week yet. It's like his weekend coat. So I've got my gloves. He's changing that. This is his coat. This is like his weekend coat. And then his nursery coat is the bright blue one. And um, so this is, yeah, his weekend coat, which is um, his FNF one. I think it's probably Little Girls, but I don't actually care. It's gorgeous. So gorgeous. I love it. I think it was only like, hmm, maybe 15, but it was reduced at the time. So love that. Love it, don't we? It's obviously going to get messy, but it's fine. It's really cosy. Love it. Um, I've got my hat in here. My hat. George's hat. I think I would have shown you this at some point this week. I'm not entirely sure, but George wears this on the colder days, and it's got Velcro at the bottom, so he can't just rip his hat off, which is very helpful. George is currently going through Mummy's makeup, so that's great. I'm going to put all of this stuff back in. I've also got a change of clothes. Um, and then we're going to go to our play date, and I will catch up with you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hello guys, it's now Sunday, the final day of our sort of what we wear in a week video, I guess. Today, or should I say this morning, this is what I'm wearing and then in the afternoon I'm actually going out so I'm just going to change this sweatshirt for a like more dressy top um, and then this will be like a brunch outfit but now at the moment it's just an at home outfit. I only put the boots on 
so that I could show you guys the outfit rather than I'm not wearing these in the house, obviously. Um, so at the moment, I've just got my tan leather look leggings from Zara. I've got my boots from m &S. And then at the moment, I've just got this like cropped um, sweatshirt thing on from, this is from ASOS, but it's a uh, Chelsea Piers one. Yeah, I just love Chelsea Piers loungewear and pyjamas. So yeah, I got this probably about two years ago now. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much all I'm wearing. Nothing too, you know, exciting. I've got my coat down there, the long one I wore to work. This is my long coat that I'm gonna be wearing when I go to brunch. Um, I'll probably just do it up. I'm just gonna show you what George is wearing again. Very standard for him on a weekend, so I'll show you now. And then this is what George is wearing. Guys, it's now Monday morning and I'm editing the video that you are watching right now. Um, I actually just don't know where the footage went for George's Sunday outfit, but basically, if you wanted to know, his hoodie was from George Asda. It was the other one from the multi-pack that he wore on the other day so like the town one and then this was the cream one um and then his leggings were from h&m but that's pretty much all i had to show you anyway i really hope you enjoyed this video let me know what your like feedback is on it because if i'm honest i struggled more filming this than i thought i would so let me know what your thoughts are any tips if i were to do another video like this what you would prefer to see any better methods of maybe george's outfits i have no idea how to actually like get that part nailed down because he's not a fan of doing it in the mornings and it's just more stressful than I thought it would be. But give this video a like if you did enjoy it and I'll know whether I should do more or I should just not bother um, because I'm not entirely sure on whether this was a good video or not. I do love watching other people's like outfit ideas and stuff but I'm just not sure if it's something that I'm very good at myself. Um, so yeah, but I will love you and leave you and I'll see you in the next one which is gonna be a week in the life which I know you guys are gonna enjoy. Bye guys, love you. You glue all the pieces back together. Yeah, you, you take all my wrongs and make them better. Yeah, you, you're making me want to try forever. I feel so free. Oh, my sweet baby.